Maharashtra's no helmet, no petrol rule. After massive opposition from the Congress party and petrol pump unions across Maharashtra and dilly dallying for days, finally, the Transport Minister Divakar Raute has tweaked the proposed no helmet, no petrol rule. Now, the onus, we learn, lies on the police to enforce the rule. Amita Balachandra joins us live with the latest details. Amita, what are you hearing? Well, uh, the traffic police begs to differ, uh, Kavita, at this point in time. They say that uh, uh, stringent uh, action uh, will be taken on uh, uh, motorists uh, who are not wearing helmets, even pillion riders, in fact, uh, who are not wearing helmets, uh, uh, or starting uh, this on the 6th of August, that is tomorrow. Uh, what we're also picking up is that, uh, of course, uh, Transport Minister Divakar Raute in the Assembly mentioned that uh, petrol pumps... Uh, can give petrol to uh, motorists uh, who are not wearing helmet as well. Uh, this, the traffic police says, is only to ensure safety of petrol pumps at this point in time, so that the responsibility of law and order lies on uh, the police. In fact, uh, all of the rest of the rules that were applicable are still applicable at this point in time. Two policemen will be stationed at every uh, petrol pump. Uh, there are 223 petrol pumps uh, in uh, Mumbai and a CCTV camera will be there. Uh, policemen will be monitoring uh, uh, and making sure that uh, motorists uh, wear helmet. Also, another thing that we're picking up is that uh, now uh, petrol pumps uh, uh, will owners will also have to uh, sort of uh, uh, intimate, uh, I mean, they have to tell uh, uh, you know, uh, the traffic police or the nearest RTO about uh, motorists who are not wearing helmet and uh, the traffic police tells us that uh, petrol pump union is in complete control census with this and this will begin from the 6th of August. The first three months is really about creating awareness uh, of this rule and that has already begun. Banners will be put up starting uh, tomorrow at all petrol pumps and uh, the traffic police at this point in time begs to differ. In fact, they say that it's not a rollback but just to make sure that petrol pumps uh, are not held responsible. No, it's definitely not a rollback. Uh, seeing the situation and the apprehension of the uh, Petrol Pump Dealers Association about uh, 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 the sensitivity of the petrol pump, the inflammable uh, substance on which they are sitting and operating, they would definitely uh, would not want any law and order situation to be developed uh, at such a sensitive place. Mm. So agreeing to this... Uh, uh, so they would, uh, if if they are forced to, or if they are forced to, uh, uh, to dispense petrol in any vehicle uh, to a dry, to a rider who is not who is not having a helmet, they'll still dispense the petrol, but they'll note down the number of the uh, the registration number of the uh, vehicle and hand it over to the traffic police for further action. Also, tell us uh, what is the fine uh, limit now uh, for people who violate this rule, who, who are not wearing, wearing helmets in Mumbai. Also, is there uh, a fine uh, that will be imposed on petrol pumps who don't, uh, uh, who, uh, you know, sort of give petrol uh, for people who don't wear helmets or don't intimate you in uh, advance? Uh, the fines uh, for uh, such kind of traffic violation for not wearing helmet uh, by both the rider and the pillion is now increased from 100 rupees to 500 rupees. Mm. Uh, that's applicable in the uh, whole of Maharashtra. So uh, we'll start uh, enforcing the law also. And uh, uh, as uh, uh, you all know, uh, we'll be starting our awareness drive from tomorrow onwards uh, about the no helmet, no petrol. Mm. Uh, we'll try to make people aware, uh, convince them that uh, wearing helmet is for their own safety. And uh, uh, after uh, the counselling and the awareness session, then we'll uh, start enforcing the law. Uh, I was just coming to that. What about what happens to the awareness, uh, 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 you know, program that you're planning to uh, conduct for the next three months, uh, where petrol pumps are supposed to put up banners, etc., etc., and uh, support this? Uh, what happens to that now with uh, this rollback? Yeah, uh, there is no rollback, as I'm again saying. Okay. Uh, uh, pet quite a few petrol pumps have already come up with the banners of uh, this uh, uh, safety initiative by Mumbai Traffic Police. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, about uh, um, uh, this uh, safety initiative and uh, we, uh, we we would be uh, going on uh, going ahead with this uh, safety drive tomorrow onwards uh, there would be traffic police constables and police station uh, constable uh, posted at uh, these petrol pumps 
counseling uh, the riders uh, uh, to wear helmets uh, for their own safety. Also, uh, will each petrol pump now still have two policemen like the previous plan and uh, CCTV cameras? Yes, of course, there will be two constables, uh, one traffic uh, and one police station guy from tomorrow onwards at each of the petrol pumps. Right, so starting Saturday, be prepared to shell out 500 rupees per head uh, for the rider and the pillion rider if you're not wearing helmets in Mumbai, uh, which is, uh, sorry, in Maharashtra, not just Mumbai. And also, you're going to find it difficult to buy petrol. So the better thing to do is to go out, buy your helmet and start wearing it. You can watch live TV on our website, mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magicbricksnow. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at magicbricksnow. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magicbricksnow.